you know, there was one team that we didn't want to play and it was probably the Eagles. There was a team we didn't want to play. We watched the game because you guys played Melbourne the next day and we watched it and we mm. were thinking, quarter time, yeah, we're playing the Eagles because you guys are... <laughs> and then you scored a goal the first half. You were destroying them. <laughs> um, and we knew that, yeah, our work was going to be cut out for us. So I just remember the week. I just wanted to appreciate the week, um, you know, just take everything in knowing that this, you know, might never get this opportunity again. I've just had a double hammy and I've been able to get back and play. So... Um, enjoy the grand final parade and then yeah I'll just you know get out there and, and soak it all up I got out there extremely early grand final day I knew where my friends and family were sitting so I went up and gave them a hug and spoke to them for a bit and and then yeah the game starts and it's kind of a blur I remember the so I just remember being up five goals to nothing and thinking sitting on the bench and I remember I think um, Will, Will Hoskinelli kicked the goal to put us five goals up and yep. it was just is this really like are we gonna you know, run on top of them. What's happening here? Everything's going our way. Nothing's going the Eagles' way. The, they had the first shot on goal, which I think Josh Kennedy missed. Had another shot, which missed. And I thought, you know, the crowd is um, you know, pretty even, but there's definitely going to be a bias here towards Collingwood because being in Melbourne. And um, and then from there, it was kind of just an arm wrestle. And, yeah, it was, again, just a blur, just a blur. I was thinking about <clears throat> um, moments in that game and things to talk to you about and, you popped into my mind. I don't know if you remember interactions we had on the day. I don't know if you remember. I think, yeah, I, I think you were, you were on Geordie, were you? Yeah, well, I was on Geordie, but don't worry about it. I want to speak to Geordie about that. I want, oh, okay. you, you, and, you and I, like we specifically, so my teammates talk about my game. That's the best game I've ever played in my life. Yeah, and you are when, unreal. When I, when, I, when I was playing, people used to say that. I said, oh, piss off. I've played for 14 years. <laughs> I must have played a better game. Now I'm finished. I'm well aware that's it's the best game. right at the top and everything else is a long distance second. Yeah. But in the game, I was in this sort of mode where like we were going to win and I, we were going to win when the game, before the game started. When five goals down, I still thought we were going to win. win. And I remember having a, literally a chat to you in the middle of the ground. Well, we, this Would have been second or third, yeah, yeah, I do remember. And you said something like, I don't know, whatever. Well, you, you were lipping off, I was lipping off. <laughs> and whatever you said, I replied with, I'll fucking see you at the end, at the end of the game. game. That's right. right, I do remember, <laughs> remember this. Uh, yes. I, and I, don't, I, I talk shit to players, yeah. but I specifically remember this because – it was almost like we'd sat down at a table and been <laughs> yeah. like, right, we're going to have a chat about this at the end of the game. Because <laughs> yeah. I was literally grand final, 100,000 people. That's right, because I was resting forward. No, what happened is I was resting forward and you were you were playing on the resting mid that was going forward. And this is how I remember because you were playing so bloody good. And you were um, just hitting me and Geordie from behind. Yes. And I don't even know. I don't even remember what I said. And I do remember you saying, I'll see you at the end of the game. And pretty much we'll win. And I'm like, no, you won't. Yes, <laughs> this is exactly no, right. You no, no, you won't. won't. And then... I kept seeing you. Anytime I saw you, I said, I see you in the game. We'll win. win. And like, (laughs) to your credit, thinking about it, you would like, it was just so strange because it was such a competitive game. And like, you wanted to win, we wanted to win. But like, it was almost like we had this thing during that game. Like every time I'd see you, I'd be like, I'll see you after the game. (laughs) And you're like, no, you won't, mate. (laughs) Anyway, the game goes how it goes and I'll come back on that. But I remember after the game, shaking your hand. And going, I, I, go, I told you. I told you so. But like, not <laughs> but arrogant. No hard feelings. No, no. I was like, I told no, you, and you were like, yeah, you did, mate. Like, yeah. congratulations. See, I was that, like, I see that's the beauty that. of – that's what I love about um, sport is we can be like that out there and then at the end of the game – and I was devastated, mate. I was – you know, I bore my eyes out for for a good uh, couple of years. No, for a, <laughs> for a couple, um, yeah. only for a couple of hours. But um, I'm sorry. And, 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 uh, some scars. Yeah, no, 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 that's fine. But – um. After obviously after that, the fact that we were able to, I guess, embrace and you know, well done, mate. It was no hard feelings, and it was, um, you know, you were right. You were right. <laughs> that's what you said, and yeah. I was like, it's always stuck with yeah. me. And yep. I, that's why I've been. I've loved to talk to you about it, see if yeah. you remembered, because I remembered, and it wasn't like my arrogance. It was no, more like what a like what a like what a genuine moment. Like yeah. it could have quite easily been the other way. Yep. And I would have just the same way gone. Oh, well, you were yeah. right. You said you were. You well, said you were going to yeah. win. The thing is, I would never. I would never. Never take anything. Anything is said on the field, like in in those reg- – never take no. that personal at all. No. Like it's great. It's banter. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> it's great. I mean, it happened on the weekend. Like there's a couple of times with the Port Boys and bu- us going back at each other and, you know, at the end of the game we see each other. I was like, yeah, hey, you won. But yeah. You won. <laughs> no good. Did – um. Where were you when she kicked? Like, do you think about it? Do you think about always. this game at all? No. Do you, do you think about it or is it like, what, like, no, no. So I, played a, I played in a losing grand final 2015. Mm. Don't think about it. I literally just put it out my brain. Well, yeah, it's different to the one I lost in Melbourne. I don't think about that one against Melbourne, sorry. I don't think about that one because of the way we lost. Yep. We The game was over 20 minutes ago in the last. Yeah. I think about this one a lot because it's the closest I've been and plus the way in the game was played. And, 
I always see that it's regarded as the best game of um, pretty much all time. It's always voted as right up there as number one or two. And I always, yeah, I, I quite often think about it. I quite think about um, what could have been different. And I remember the whole play building up to Sheed, obviously taking the mark and kicking the goal where yeah, I was. You kicked it into the forward line. Yeah, I remember Jordy was running away from the ball and I was kind of hoping he came back at it and I just kicked it as long as I could. And McGovern made one of the great plays as, as a defender. And then his kick was even better. And then mm. Liam Ryan obviously took that great mark on Tom Langdon, who hasn't, who hadn't been outmarked the whole final series, <laughs> was was playing unbelievable. And then obviously the kick to Sheed, and not like I remember the play, do I? But yeah, <laughs> I, um, I remember the play and um, illegal shepherd. Or? Absolutely, no, I was, I no, it was. I look, yeah, it was. I look back, no, I don't. I think in those moments it's hard to call. Maybe if you know the team's up by ten goals, maybe call it. But in those moments it's hard to call it because you see him knock it called and you see him get called. So. You know, I wish it was called because it could have been a little bit different. But, you know, we just shouldn't have let you guys back into the game. We're up by five goals. That's mm-hmm. how I look at it. I think we should have we should have been able to continue that momentum. What I think really hurt us is the goal that we allowed at the end of the first quarter. I think it was like a dribble along the ground where it was kind of a fluke goal. Yeah. It wasn't really – it was like off the boot of – it was Rioli. I mean, it yeah. might have been Rioli. Yeah. At the bottom yeah. of his shoe. Yeah, yeah, literally. And it was – if that was a point, we go – five goals rather than go up because I think you guys kicked another goal just prior yeah, to that two in the last minute mm. and I think if they goals. weren't allowed sorry if that didn't happen we would have been yeah a lot I more agree. confident oh and we would have been you know, yeah and you guys going five been goals down like, haven't yeah. scored a goal yeah so there's time. moments in the game where mm. you just like yeah but I'm proud mate I'm, I, I've got my grand final jersey hung up I'll always be proud of being able to get back and play in that game again I'll talk about um, I just mentioned, you know, being one of the great games that the, our sport has ever seen and people regard it as one of that. And quite often you get people talk about, you know, what a game that was for both sides. It's something that I'm proud of and I'll always be proud of that. Mm. One thing I um, sort of learned in the last year or so is that the team that loses the grand final still has the, like, the dinner, mm. the night of the grand final. What was that like for you guys? Um, oh, it was, a, it was quite sombre in the rooms afterwards, but then give us, you know, half an hour, everyone – you know, teared up, had their tears and their loved ones. We all got together and then as soon as you have a beer or so, it's pretty good from there. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so it wasn't too bad. It, we had all our friends and family there and, you know, I said I'll, I'll, I'll say that it's one of the great nights that I've ever had, one of the great nights. Of it. I can only imagine winning one. Mm. can only imagine what that would be It's like. actually – you drink – I've done both. Uh, you, you, you have more – well, not more fun, but you get more pissed after yeah. losing. Yeah, You, like, carry on you more than you lost, whereas, yeah. like, winning, you just, like, like – Well, you've got a lot more sleep. commitments, don't you? Yeah, you but, you, do a lot more but it's more and... like – mate, it's just relief. Like, you, you, you're chasing a flag, right? And yeah. it's like we don't have to bounce around that. Like, yeah. you want, you've want you played in two losing grand finals, you've played in losing, uh, losing prelims, prelims, winning prelims, right? Like, I'd assume you can say it for yourself. Like, that's what you're chasing, right? That's mate, what it's you're... the only reason I'm playing now. Yeah. I, as I said, I think about – I've mentioned 218 that I wanted to retire um, mm. and I think back why I do it and, and, yeah, it's the whole reason I play. And, you know, when I knew that I was um, having to leave Collingwood, my, you know, my first thought straight away was, oh, where's a team that I think is capable of winning? And that's obviously the Bulldogs. And we came really close in 21 and I still think, you know, our best footy is as good as anybody's. We just need to play consistently that brand of footy that we need to play and, and, and bring um, our best, which is – at the moment, again, we're doing that inconsistently. But, yeah, I, I thoroughly believe in the group that we have and, and it's the whole reason why I play.